What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Zamo's Gaming and today we're going to be playing a little bit of Empyreon Galactic Survival. So I have not played this game in like a year or more. Uh, I had a short series on it back in, I don't know, version 1.8, maybe something like that. And we're all the way up to version 1.10. I took a quick look at the change log here. Um, I haven't really paid a whole lot of attention to the development of this game because I played it a ton, like before the last series that I did. But anyway, we're gonna hop into a new game today and just kind of see how it is now. I may end up making a short series out of it and I'm not sure when this video is gonna come out, but but I will put it out eventually. And 1.10 came out like at the end of June, which is like a couple weeks ago now. So we're gonna start a new game. Uh, we're gonna go with survival. And I was looking at the options for this earlier. I have pretty much always started on Akua. This one might be an interesting one to start off. N Ningiz, Ningiz, I don't know how to say that. Um, but then there's Skillin and then there's Masperon. Uh, and then whatever this is, the Ashen 2 Orbit, which sounds nuts. I don't know why you'd want to do something like this. And it says difficulty is pretty hard. So we're going to skip out on that. And actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to start out on skill on. It says difficulty is medium to high. Could be a, a huge mistake. I have no idea. But what we're going to do is we are going to make some adjustments to um, some of the settings here. So what I'm going to do, I've made some like small adjustments here and set player progression to fast, degradation speed to slow. Uh, everything I think, I set some of the ore deposits, like changed some of that kind of stuff, but left everything, oh, did I did change like crafting speed, that kind of thing, because I really, basically what I'm trying to do with the settings is I just want to make it to where it's not as grindy, but uh, enemy difficulty, I'll leave all that stuff in meaning. I think setting that to hard makes it like super, super fucking hard, so I don't want that. I, I want to actually enjoy the game, so <laughs> we'll just start a new game. And we'll call this one Gemo uh, V10. Yeah, sure. I don't know. All right, well, let's go ahead and start this. Ooh, deposits kind of suck. Carbon, Promethium. I mean, how bad could it be? Let's give it a shot, man. I don't know. I don't honestly don't know how this is going to go because, like I said, I have uh, never played on this particular planet before. Never started on this particular planet, anyway. No. Oh. Okay. Oh. Mail and continue? I don't know. Uh, let's just try to continue. Oh, okay. I I guess it's fine. I'm not sure what that was all about. Ah! Maybe that's what that's all about? Oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. Was that a bad idea? Should I have not done that? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, no. Should I have not done that? Oh, yeah. I definitely shouldn't have done that. Oh, hold on. Yeah, no, we're dead. <laughs> oh, looks like my ship is actually falling. So I don't know, maybe I'll be able to get some stuff back. I also started out with no, like no health, no nothing. Uh, okay, well, let's just grab some of this stuff. We're gonna grab our backpack. I feel like the ship is gonna fall directly on that. We also have some like bad radiation. We'll just take all. Yeah, sure. I don't, uh... I guess we should put the survival survival tool down here. We'll put that down. Uh, let's put that there. And let's put the bandages there. Okay, so it looks like our ship is about to land. What is that thing? Hopefully it's not hostile. So, oop. Okay, ooh. Rescue pod. All right. Um... Can... Is there any, like, ability for this thing to move? Okay, so there's no oxygen on this planet. So I'm trying to find out if there's a, like, if there's a chest in this and also how to access it. That's what I was looking for. P. Okay. So what do we have? Do we have a, uh, like, a chest or anything on here that I can access? Cargo box. No cargo box. Okay, so I should probably just leave that here and roll a hell out because um i think the main issue i'm going to run into on this planet is there's uh no oxygen and um should probably have that out right what are the uh, what are the options for this oh salvage mode let's go to defense mode just in case i guess we could kind of switch back and forth resource mode oh what does that do am i getting anything out of that 
Looks like it's just like disappearing. Pick up fire moss scraping. All right, I'm just I'm grabbing a bunch of stuff. I don't know if this is if any of this stuff is going to be helpful, but grabbing it nonetheless. What is that thing? I should probably avoid whatever that thing is. <laughs> should probably stay the fuck away from that. Oh wait a minute. Okay, so this appears to be something. Oops, ex I got an explorer token. Okay, whatever that was, did it go into my inventory? It did. Okay, so... Oh. One of the trading stations. Oh, okay, and I got some copper ore out of it. Okay, so I am getting some ore. Um, but yeah, I do believe I'm gonna need to be cognizant of my oxygen. Food's not looking great either. Oh, lord. How do I get oxygen, by the way? Oh, God, this looks awful. Okay, well, let's grab whatever this is. All right, I got another Explorer token. I'm not sure what those are. Like, I don't, I've never heard of that before uh, in my years of playing this game. So that's just giving me crushed stone. I don't know how helpful that is. I'm also trying to just be careful of any, like, any and all creatures, essentially. I just want to avoid critters and creatures, because I feel like any of them could just murder me. But I am grabbing a bunch of this stuff. Um, just everything I can possibly find, so I can hopefully start making some shit, because I'm definitely going to need, going to need food. I'm going to need all that kind of crap here shortly. So, in fact, let's go ahead and eat ourselves a little bar. Let's eat a bar. Let's go ahead and eat another bar. Um, wow, I'm, I'm leveling up really quick. That might have been a mistake. What is that? That looks like that might be helpful. Oops, oh shit, I didn't... Oops, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> okay. All right, let's go ahead and grab this thing over here. All right, oxygen's going down. All right, let's take a quick look and see if there's anything I can make. Um, I can make an O2 condenser. Requires biofuel. What does that do? Generates small O2 bottles and purifies water. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna need that sooner than later, I guess. Why is that unlock or blocked? Do I need to unlock it? I'm also kind of like I keep hearing the radiation ticking. There's there's that. Okay. So so, miscellaneous. I'm looking for the portable constructor. I should probably unlock... Oh, wow. I, ha I already have a lot of points. Heater, cooler. I'm assuming this planet gets hot. Am I Am I hot? Eh, 104. That's... I don't know if this is one of these planets that gets really cold at night. Um, okay, that's a lot of crushed stone. And I want to say you can actually take crushed stone and turn that into stuff. Uh, <laughs> I think I think you can take crushed stone and a certain amount of it can be turned into like ore and stuff. This planet's gravity is really fucked, isn't it? That's that's why I'm like kind of bouncing around like this. All right, carbon substrate. So maybe I should walk across the sandy dunes and go check that place out. But let's uh, switch over to defense mode. I don't know if those are those guys are friends or what. But I'm going to kind of steer clear of them. It's also really hot out here, and the radiation is much higher. So what actually keeps track of my radiation? Oh, Jesus. So radiation is... Am I at, like, 0.1 radiation now? What is that? I don't know what that is. All right. I mean, I'm just trying to make my way over here. Hopefully this isn't like a huge mistake coming over here. Oh, wow. There's a whole ass planet over there. Okay. <sighs> Let's see. We got something showing up in red over there. Oh, it's a drone. Okay. Should definitely avoid that then now, shouldn't we? Discovered old tank station. Ooh. Hope. Hope this isn't a place where critters like to live. I don't want any critters. Hold on. So can I just shift F on this? Will that work? 
I don't, can't remember how all that stuff works. Projectile rough around. Okay. So I'm getting some buzzets, but no no weapons to fire them. Energy pills. All right. Okay. Got to got to be careful of that drone there. I really don't want to deal with the drones just yet. <laughs> drones are no no bueno right now anyway. All right. So let's. Ooh. This place looks creepy as hell. I really hope nothing weird spawns in here. Got two computers. Got some mechanical components. Uh... Okay, so here's my question. Can I salvage any of this stuff? Well, radiation's really high now. I should probably get out of here. Okay, steel plate. So is radiation high because I'm at this place? Okay. Oh, okay, so that that place is not a good place to be. Got it. I don't know if those things are friend or foe. Hold on, let me let me check something here. I keep hitting random buttons because I I don't know. I don't know how this game works. Alright, well, we're gonna find out if these things are friend or foe. I'm just trying to figure this out, man. I I don't know what's up yet. Well, they're not shooting at me yet. Oh, okay. I'm not sure if they're friends or not. Where'd that other drone go, anyway? Alright. We're gonna come back over here, because this... There was a lot less radiation over here. Is that a critter? Oh, wow, that's a... That's a big boy. Yikes. Stay the hell away from the big boys. We don't want the big boys to <laughs> come after us. <laughs> I'm just not really in a position to fight anything right now. Um, also, I'm really not in a position to, like, fill my oxygen up if I need to do that. So, whoops. Let's switch that over to south. Nope. Mm, resource. <laughs> there we go. That's an iron bearing. I'm sure I'm sure we'll need some iron here soon. Keep getting these explorer tokens. It says something about, like, I guess you can go somewhere and turn it in for a reward or whatever. There we go. All right, so that gets us back up here. Uh, oh, what's that? Is that is that a bad place? I don't know if that's a bad place or not. I don't know if that's just going to kill me if I go over there. All right, let's check and see. Do I have any oxygen? No, I don't. All right, so I need to make... I need to make one of these things now. How do you make it? Oh, uh, hold on. There we go. Okay, just need to make one. Probably should have started with that because I may end up dying. This might this might have been like way too hard of a start for me since I have not played the game in a while. But that's 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 what we're all about here on Demos Gaming. We're all about the challenge, man, and just just giving it our all and <laughs> probably dying. That's probably what's going to happen, to be honest. Because um, yeah, radiation's still ticking up. I don't really have anything I can do about that. I wonder if, like, the tents or, or any of that kind of stuff can, like, reduce radiation or mitigate it. See, these guys, I'm a little hesitant to, um, can I actually go into the ground with this? Oh, you can. I wonder if going underground is helpful. Just, like, getting out of, okay, so our temperature's already going down. I'm just curious if this helps with the radiation, though. I doubt it, but I feel like it's worth trying. Okay, so we made ourselves a nice little hole here underground. I don't know if that's going to help us at all. And it's, yeah, it's not helping us with the radiation at all, so that's fine. Okay, so what does the tent do? Effective against hangover bed. Rested. Okay, so this doesn't help with radiation or any of that kind of stuff, so that's not going to help us at all. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this thing down. Um, so what can I put in this for... Can I make biofuel? Is that something I can make? How do you how do you make biofuel? I saw that that's what that requires, but I don't really know what that means. Oh, carbon, carbon substrate? All right. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have a feeling I might end up dying before I can actually do this, but I'm trying to figure out I should probably, yeah, what I probably should have done before I went out there is tried to, like, just craft some stuff. Um, <laughs> this, is, this is really tough. 
That's right, we're figuring you are figuring it out as we go, man. We're figuring it out as we go. Um, all right, let's make an energy bar as well. Let's make two of those because I'm running low on food. So I don't have that. I'm not going to worry about that just yet. Uh, once we get this portable constructor, I'm going to put that down and hopefully this makes biofuel out of something. You know, I don't know. Um, I do remember in the past with biofuel. Okay, so what can can we make? Biofuel, yes. Uh, what makes what makes biofuel? Plant fibers. Yes, go ahead. We are up against the clock here at this point, so we're making some biofuel. I had just enough plant fibers to do that, but that answers kind of an important question is like, well, kind of sort of answers an important question is, is it going to be difficult for me to like keep making this shit regularly? Because I don't even know if I do this biofuel, I don't know how long this is going to last. Or like how much oxygen I'm gonna be able to get out of it, because obviously that's the main thing right now is I'm I'm running low on oxygen. I gotta get this going quickly. So all right, let's do that. And then source quality is 13%. What does that mean? Does that mean I'm like I'm not in a good place to to make this? Probably if I was like by the water, it would make better stuff, right? I shouldn't be doing this, by the way. I should probably just go underground and wait. But I'm hoping I can grab maybe some more plant proteins. That's our plant fibers. Yeah, right, 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 right. So this is aloe, right? Okay, that's herbal leaves. That's for, I think you can just like chew those and that will kind of be in watching, watching my, uh, oh, oh, okay, we're down to 13. Oxygen. I need to not be jumping around doing all that. God, I don't know if I'm going to be able to use this in time. Because my oxygen's going down. Okay, we're at seven. <laughs> Five. Come on, man. Hurry up. I need some oxygen, brother. I need to breathe, man. Oh my god, I'm down to one oxygen. As soon as I get this, I have to take it immediately. Holy shit, that scared the crap out of me. Oh boy. Okay, and unfortunately I need six more plant fibers in order for me to make more of that. <sighs> okay, plant, no, so that's plant protein. So I think it's the yellow flowers is what I need. All right, well, I'm going to keep grabbing stuff while I'm at it. Ugh, this is just, this is going to be really tough. Oh. What was that? Something hit me. I don't know what it is. Oh, oh, shit, I'm getting shot at by something. Oh, a fucking drone. Shit. Can he get to me down here? Let's take a bandage real quick. <sighs> I, uh, dude, I didn't even realize he was shooting at me. <sighs> Hopefully he just fucks off and leaves me alone. Cause I honestly don't think I can really fight him properly. Okay, um, so we're on operational for like 11 minutes. So, okay, so we should be okay then. Uh, although I can't, until he leaves, I can't go out and get more of that stuff. Alright, so we're going to take some more energy bars and eat eat those. Alright, we're doing okay here. We're doing alright. Everything's fine. <laughs> Everything's fine. <laughs> Let's just make let's just make a crap load more of these. Uh, I feel like that's probably our best bet right now. Uh, but I am gonna start loading this in with just yeah some crushed stones. We'll throw in the stuff that we got before. I don't know if some of these things are kind of more advanced materials, so I don't even know if that's really gonna help us right now. Um, can we eat? Oh, we can just eat that, and that actually gives us twenty five health. Interesting. Oh, no. Oh, what happened? Dude, are you for real? All right, so apparently I'm having a bad trip right now. 
Uh, effects of against hangover and bad trips. So we're gonna put that down. I can't. I can't see. I can't see. Okay, hold on. Let's go resource mode. I'm just gonna try to, like... I can't see anything, though, so I'm just hoping I can push this out far enough. Um, here, let's grab that. Pure, oh, purified water? Bro, I don't need that. I know, I'm, like, dying right now, because... Here, just eat all of those. Uh, I'm trying to put this down so I can... I don't know if I'm going to be dead by the time I wake up, but... Okay, so I thought that... It said that that would help me against bad trip, and clearly it didn't, and I'm still dying and I have no food. <sighs> what? I know, because you said that the tent would help me with bad trip, and then it didn't. Hold on, fire moss scraping say they help <sighs> against that? Okay. <sighs> Okay, so I'm dying. <laughs> I don't know all the controls. Um, okay, here we go. Alright. So, I'm almost dead. Let's use a bandage. Okay, so good to know. So, we can't eat these. Process further to avoid harmful side effects. Okay, I should have read that. Should have read that. <laughs> Okay. All right. Is there... Uh, I have a light on this. Okay. That's good to know. Still getting radiated here. Ah, <sighs> fucking hell, bro. This is... This is so stupid. All right. Can I make... Can I make that into something that's actually fucking helpful and it's not just going to kill me instantly? Yeah. Because I just... I wasted a lot of, like, resources just then. Um, trying to do that. Okay. So let's do another energy bar. I think that's gonna knock us out of the plant protein, but we're alive. Okay. That was kind of a moment of sheer panic, but but we're good. We all right. Um sorry, so good to know the tent does not help against bad trip. Why did it say it did? Effective against hangover and bad trip. You cannot sleep when enemies are nearby? Okay. So that lies. That's a lying bullshit tent. It doesn't help with any of those things. I, I, or at least if, if it does, it doesn't explain well how it works. And I'm like a big, you know, that's like a big pet peeve of mine. If you're gonna give me an option, like if you're gonna say like, oh, this does this, then you need to explain, like, okay, is it just a chance that it's going to help me with that? Or does it actually do what it says it's going to do? Because if not, it's not very helpful. <laughs> All right, so we're kind of, we're still keeping an eye out um, for drones. We still need to keep an eye out for drones. Um, I'm going to grab all of this stuff as well. Okay, and just grabbing plants, grabbing all kinds of plants and stuff. Grab a, that was a carbon substrate, fire moss scrapings. That's good. I actually probably, shit, I shouldn't be doing that. I should actually be leaving those there because that might be the, you know, one thing that can help me against bad trip if that happens again. But hopefully that never happens again. Hopefully that was just a fluke and never happens again. All right. It's an iron bearing. It's good. What's this? Oh, I have some fruit. Lovely. Some lovely little fruits. Okay. Um, can I... I can. Okay. And what is... Does this give me plant fiber? If I remember correctly, that's what the trees do. They give you plant fiber. You give me... No, wood logs. Oh, it's cold. Okay. All right. Let's, um... Fucking hell, dude. <laughs> it's always something! Yeah, stamina just, like, tanked just then, I guess, when I got too cold. Um, now, the question is, will that heater, or the heater thing, will that actually help me? 
Cause I don't know, man. And we're gonna take a little bit more oxygen here. I'm gonna go down into the depths of this and hope that the temperature normalizes. It did not. Okay, so I need more of that. I need more um, biofuel. But that's okay. I don't I don't need biofuel right now. What I need is I, I need that portable heater. Portable heater cooler. Let's do that. Okay, because once again, my food looks like it's rapidly dropping because I'm too cold. <sighs> <sighs> Heal with rise temperature. Okay, yeah, I, I know, I know. Um, do I have any... Uh, let's see. Can I make a hot beverage? I need two buds for that. So no, that won't help. Uh, my health is at 88. I don't know when, like, I don't know if I would actually start taking damage from that or what. So let's see. It looks like whatever that is is about to run out. Yep, okay. No, we're good. Stunned. And I'm stunned right now. <laughs> okay. Dude. It's just hitting me with all this shit at one time. I'm like, okay, I don't... What do you want me to do about it? All right, well, let's try to put this thing down. And um, I think as long as we can stand next to this, we should be fine. Yes, <sighs> our, our temperature's good. We're good to go. Are we... No, we're not too cold. We're fine. 77 degrees. If you are too cold and it's 77 degrees, then you have, like, an, an anemic problem. Something wrong with your blood, dog. <sighs> All right, let's make some biofuel. Jesus. We have spoiled food in there now. What's the spoiled food from? Probably the mushrooms, right? Yeah, let's just throw those mushrooms in there. I can't do anything with them right now anyway, so we'll just do that. Thankfully, the fire moss scrapings... Oh, they actually minus 50 to your health. I didn't even know that. We'll just put those in there, too. <laughs> What are herbal leaves? Use? I don't. See, I don't remember. I can't remember all this crap. We'll throw the logs in there as well. Uh, let's just do. Let's do some more of that. Cause I, I do remember. Okay, I think the wood logs is what makes the. Uh, that's what makes the um, plant protein or, or or the plant fibers. <clears throat> yeah, wood logs turns into plant fibers. Okay, so we're, we're good on that. What was that sound? Hello. Any bolts through there? Oh, the other thing that we're gonna need here. So we're making some biofuel now. Um, I also need to go ahead and make some more of these, I suppose. Meat. Okay. How do you make meat? Vegetables. <laughs> you can make meat out of vegetables. No, you can't. No, I'm kidding. It's fine. It's fine. It's, it's the future. We can make meat out of anything we want to make it out of, I guess. But, all right. So, let's make sure... Oops. Let's make sure that this is going... Okay, yeah. Energy items. Keep keep rolling there. Keep making me oxygen. This is, like, super survival here. Like, normally at this point in the game, like, I already have a base going. Like, I'm, I'm good. Or, or I'm, like, going around, like, a Kua, and I'm trying to figure out, like, you know, my base situation, all that. Right now, I'm just trying to survive, bro. I'm just trying to, to stay alive. We're just trying to, like, flatten out our surroundings here. Because what I may end up doing is if I build a base, I'm going to build it down here. Like, I'm not even joking. Because I just feel like the surface of this planet is so inhospitable that we're better off doing that. How do you get your health back? Is it you just don't get health back? Like, how does that work? Because these fucking energy bars aren't doing anything. Okay. All right, let's, uh, let's put some stuff in there. Um... Let's throw some more biofuel in there. Let's go ahead and take two energy bars. Get my health up a little, or get get my food up. It's not gonna help my health at all. What I, okay, so I think that some of the food items help with health, if I remember correctly. We have an antibiotic ointment. That's effective against dermal burn, frostbite, and necrosis. Anti oh, I can make an anti-radiation ointment. That's exactly what we should do. 
We should do that for sure. Plant fibers and plant protein uh, are bandages. So let's make two of those. That makes sense, right? Right, right, right. So, okay, so that's what the mushrooms are good for. The mushrooms are good for making anti-radiation ointment. Okay, I don't know if I really should use that yet because I think my radiation is at like 0.5 or whatever. So I don't really need that yet. If it's minus one, it would be kind of a waste to use that now. Um, but let's go ahead and <clears throat> apply two of the band bandages, bandagios, bandages. Why is it not letting me use the second one? <sighs> okay, there we go. I guess maybe there's a cooldown. I didn't notice it, but I guess there's a cooldown. All right, so we have a lot of purified water. Um, so maybe I should think about like if I'm gonna build a base, like yeah, build it down here. Let's let's do that. Let's do that real quick. So we need a base starter. Um, can I can I can I do that? Oh wow, that needs a lot of stuff. Should we venture out to the surface and see? Um, we can make some of those emergency O2s. I don't think that they're as effective, but that's the only way. Oh shit! You know what I should be doing? Hold on. Okay, let's do this. Let's pull that out. That's because that's 32 oxygen. If I put these in here, what does that does that give me? Little oxygen boys and girls. Yes. No. Maybe so. I can get the O2 bottles, but you can't use that in your suit. That's like for ships and stuff like that. So no, it looks like the only way to do it is you got to get them out of here. And we'll just we'll go ahead and use that one now. Um, all right, let's let's venture back out to the surface here. Um, it looks like we just got to be careful of the temperature going down too much again. We do have some of these trees I could probably take apart for more stuff. Oh yeah, we're still in resource mode, okay. What's this? Carbon substrate, nice. More plant protein, good, good, good. What's that? Uh, let's, let's, let, let's let whatever that is regrow, I guess. All right, I do see that we have a, a friend there somewhat close by, so we have to be cognizant of where they are pretty much at all times. Because otherwise, <laughs> they could come in and kill us if we get too far away from our base. But yeah. Okay. So we're we're doing fine. This is this is all right. We'll we will be just fine. I think the biggest issue that we might run into on this planet specifically is any of the um, like deposits of of stuff that'll be actually helpful for us, like. Iron, copper, all of those. Well, that's right. I don't think there are those kinds of deposits on this planet. Is there? Map. Yes. Okay. So Promethean is the meteorites, but it says that there are carbon, Promethean, and Neodymium, which is actually is a really good resource. But in the past, when I've played this game before, usually those um, were next to, like, you know something that you couldn't just walk in there and grab some right it was like <laughs> it was next to xerax base or something like that like it wasn't wasn't an easy thing to get to or it was in like territory of some faction that you weren't exactly friends with yet so you didn't want to steal shit from them and get out of their favor we don't want that now do we all right, so we got some natural stimulant. Oh, here we go. Oh, all right, so we have a friendo over there. We definitely want to try to avoid him, but there is some fruit. And I want to say fruit can be used to make good stuff. I want to be, I want to be able to see him. Let's grab those fire moss scrapings. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, let's go back to the base. Um... Yeah, one thing I do want to confirm that the crushed stone does still give you um stuff <laughs> what was I, what was I trying to say? so if i remember correctly uh it used to be crushed stone like if you had a bunch of that you could take like a certain amount and turn it into iron or copper ore like that was kind of the the point of having crushed stone you know it could find like trace amounts of copper and iron and that was that was the way that you could get that stuff if you needed it so Let's grab this. Just grabbing a little bit of everything. I don't know what the point of this stupid little tree is, so we're gonna take it out. And this is just some straight up iron. 
We're getting a lot of good stuff, so I think we're going to be just fine. I, the biggest issue is just going to be getting the fuck off this planet, because that's going to be priority numero uno. Is the whole time I'm just going to be thinking about how I can get the hell out of here. Uh, the other thing is I should probably get a hover bike going too. Yikes! Lot, lot to think about, lot to do. And I need some weapons. And I, <laughs> and I need this. And I need that. I need a lot of stuff. Thankfully, this stuff is respawning pretty quickly. So, and it's either that or I've just have not seen all this crap. The whole no. Okay, this stuff is respawning pretty fast. That's fine. I mean, I I am cool with that. This this planet sucks balls. I also need to get back because I'm about to run out of food and stuff. So. Let's go back to my hole. I gotta go back to the hole where I belong. Hold on, what is... Alright, let's... I know Curiosity killed the cat here, but... Ooh. Oh, what do we got over there? Looks like we actually have, like, a forest or something over there. Okay. Alright, we got some... We got some shit to take a look at here, for sure. God, this game is really pretty now. I may have to, like, revisit the graphic settings and make sure that they're at, like, a... You know, like, a good setting for... For what I got going on. Give me that small O2 bottle, so I can raise my O2 up a little bit. You raise my O2 up, so I cannot die. <laughs> um, mate. Let's put all this crap in there and let's try to make, let's try to make some stuff out of it. I don't, I don't, I don't know what we're gonna make today, but we're gonna try to make some stuff, okay? So let's get. Let's make a good amount of that anyway. Let's make uh, like four more bandages. Um, weapons. Projectile pistol. Should I just say fuck that and go for the assault rifle? What do I need? Electronics and mechanical components. Are the what do you um, electronics? How do you how do you make those? Am I not in a position to make electronics? Oh wow. Hoverbike construction kit. Let me go ahead and, and do one of those. I don't know what just happened. I was like, let me go help me. Uh, <laughs> and make f how many? Output count one, two, three, four. Oh, that's that's way too many. Sorry, I didn't realize that I was doing. Let's go with about six. That'll give me a hundred and hundred and fifty. And let's go with five. Let's go with that. Okay, so do you make the the construction? Do you make the bike on your person now? Like, how do you make the bike? Is do you make it? Hold on, do I make it in here? Hover bike. Hover bike. Where are you, sir? Hover bike. There we go. All right, so we're gonna set the old core down there. <clears throat> Now, I think the issue with this is once you put a core down, I think it sets up a timer and we're essentially going to we're going to start getting attacked by by drones. And I'm assuming that the drones are going to be no joke on this stupid ass planet. So, <laughs> but I am going to give myself a layer of rock in between me and them. Uh, and I may even build down more. I don't I don't know. And, and this base is really just going to be for the purpose of like building what I need to get the hell out of here. It's not going to be for the purpose of long-term setup, because this planet sucks. I hate it here. I don't like it. I want to leave. <clears throat> All right, so I guess I can't really make any better food. I can make an energy drink. Effective against stunned. Nutrient solution. That's for, like, doing farming. I don't need to do all that. What does this do? Food is 24, food is 40. This is really my best bet for food right now. It's just having a lot of these. All right. So let's go ahead and throw that down here. Um, and that is number one, as my good old trusty number one there. And oops, let's go ahead and throw that stuff in there. Don't need that out. And let's put a hover bike down. Um, I don't know how smart it's going to be to, what time is it, 10, 20, like, p.m., a.m., p.m.? Okay. This thing is kind of crazy looking now. This, I think this is something that was added in the new version. So the hover bike. 
Uh, oh yeah, look at that. I don't know if I should be heading toward any of these structures. If this, <laughs> that rock was like, no, turn around, boy. <laughs> You're going into enemy territory now. <laughs> Woo! We're gonna go check this little place out. An ancient shelter. I just don't know if I'm gonna be like within reach of things that can shoot at me and kill me. I discovered a small neodymium deposit over by what appears to be a, a base. Okay. Did I, um, I did not. Hold on, that was really dumb. I just realized I left and did not grab. Can you back up on the bike? Oh, okay, hold on. Turn around, turn around, boy. Jesus Christ, what the fuck are you doing? Oh my God, boy. Oh my God. It's so hard to turn in this. Dear Lord Jesus. Okay, hold on. Let's let's go back. Let's get out of the the radiation wasteland here, and um, let's. Oh. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> this hover bike. This is jankier than the last bike, man. Uh, let's get. There we go. Get out. Get out. Okay. F. F gets out. <laughs> oh, Sam, about to run out of oxygen again. Jesus. I need a lot of those, man. Give me two. <clears throat> let's go ahead and load that up there. Uh, let's also get another, maybe two things of biofuel, and I can just let this thing go. Just let it roll, and just just keep keep making me stuff, please. I need lots and lots of stuff. I think part of the issue is because the source quality is not good. I wonder what would happen if I put this like outside somewhere, you know, like I wonder if uh, being down here in the dark dank cave that it's in, it's not doing it any favors. But also, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. All right. So that's a good amount of food there. Uh, let's go ahead and grab a couple more. Yeah, let's grab a couple more. Uh huh. Yeah. And let's keep some of that purified water on us, because we can use those to make the emergency oxygen ones, just in case we start running low. And I want to go ahead and... Yeah, let's take... Come on, baby. Oh, there we go. All right, cool. Uh, so we got those in there. We have some stuff. Some stuff, you know, because that, that makes total sense. Is that clock going backwards? I just realized that. Oh, okay, that's that's until sundown. Uh. Got it. All right, so I think that this video has run fairly long, so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to end it right here, and then we're going to take just a quick gander at, like, maybe that place down there. I don't, Some of these places, I am not sure if we should even go into them because I feel like it's just enemy territory and we're just going to get wrecked. So, uh, yeah. All right, well, we do have our core down. We can start building out a base and start trying to put some kind of semblance of a, you know, structure <laughs> together here. I don't know. We'll figure it out. This is all just a, a bit of a challenge for us here and, and just kind of see what we can do on Demos Gaming. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please give it a like. And if you enjoyed this kind of content, then absolutely explode that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. And uh, if you are a veteran player of the game and you have any suggestions for somebody starting out on, on this fucking crazy planet, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. And just give me a shout out, even if you're not a veteran player, and just say, hey, what's, what you doing, Demos Gaming? And I'll be like, hey, what are you doing? Something like that. I don't, I don't know how the interaction will go, but it'll be something along the lines of that. So anyway, I will catch up with you on the next episode. In the meantime, if you find yourself in a situation where you're on skill on, then start getting your shit together so you can get the fuck out of there. And I'm wasting time and oxygen. I need to get on with... I need to get on with it. See you on the next episode. Peace.